Hello, I'm Entrilism, and welcome back to Battlefleet Gothic Armada Campaign. We have the Hand of Darkness. We've no idea what it does, but we have it, and that's important. The Elder are now a threat. They're wandering around and being annoying. And we've got a choice of one more deployment before the end of the turn. We can go to Acre. We could go take out some Orcs in a Cruiser Clash. Or we could do a Data Recovery at Purgatory. The problem is... I don't want the orcs to get more powerful, even if that world is kind of pointless. The flip side is... This world increases my cost of upgrades by 10% now it's taken by the enemy. So... I don't really know what I want to do. It's pretty simple. I mean, I also prefer fighting chaos to fighting orcs. Um, in general, the orcs can be very tough. They can do a lot of annoying uh, damage to you and kite you around. But I do think I want to kind of stop the orcs from snowballing, which is what they do. Because they'll take a world, and then they'll be like, they'll grow in threat, and they're more likely to attack you, and then they're more likely to attack you, and then they're more likely... I just can't allow that. So yeah, we'll take the orcs on. A small scout force has been destroyed by an enemy fleet. Reports indicate that the enemy ships are moving in our direction. 99 for victorious. We will be victorious. Okay. 500 points. So let's take... The Keeper of Goose Pig and the Divine Lotto skills. Uh, we will then take... Ooh, I only get one out of these guys. I've got an Augur. And... Oh, we're... Right, we're fighting Orcs. They have heavy front armor. I'm going to go the Dauntless because it has a length which makes armor count as 25 regardless of, you know, what it is. And then we'll take a couple of Firestorms which also have a frontal lance. Yeah. Okay. Let's kick ass. Let's do this. Take some names. Kick some butts. Get down tonight. Okay, um... Now, range does benefit me. Because my torpedoes are better. And I have a Nova Cannon. They kind of get like a knockoff Nova Cannon. But it's still not Nova Cannon. So what I might do is I might put you here with an order to go into this gas cloud. And then... You don't have torpedoes, do you? So I'll put you here. Along with these guys. Ship ready. Ooh. That Activating is a lot of them. Contracts. They must have a lot of, like, frigates with them. Alright, so let's get torpedoes in the water. Yes, Admiral. Burn retros. Okay, turn. At your command. And I'm just going to spend now. I don't really want to have them able to come through this um, gas cloud to me. So I am going to shift across slightly. Understood. Cruising speed set. And we might as well use our maneuver gauge since it's Cruising gonna fill up by the time set. they're here. Okay. Torpedoes are almost at the target. Orders received. I want to see what happens, because you can start judging what ships they are by what happens. So this is a cruiser, if it gets hit. Actually, it's probably any sort of ship that gets hit. That's a very good Yep. Two hits. Activated that was a cruiser. Because it was to the side. Or it could have been defense fire. I didn't look hard enough. Activating tactical cogitators. And let's just turn. Keep Burn it on retros. the spot. Get ready to fire. Underway. Torpedoes in the way. Yes, in the way? Admiral. On the way. That's the one. And we should be able to launch another kind of shot any minute. Activating tactical cogitators. We'll speed that up. Once they're close enough, I'll launch these guys in. And their idea is to like start fighting here so I can keep getting Nova Cannon shots. We need to get some good Nova Cannon shots. Your orders. That is our advantage. Get the Augur probe out. Probably should have fired that a lot earlier, but I forgot about it. Because I'm clever. At your command. Oh, 
Awaiting orders. Setting course. Yes. Good. That thing's taking like four torpedoes now. Your orders? Enemy ship sighted! Activating right. tactical cogitators. Reloading. All the shields down. Not that that does a lot at this range. Your orders. Changing course. We might get one more volley torpedo if we're lucky. Ship ready. The idea is I'll try and put a stasis bomb here to prevent this flank. Yes, Admiral. Engines hot. Right. Cruising speed set. At your command. Activating tactical cogitators. Slow field. Nova cannon. Yes. Activating oh, what kills! Was that three escorts? Activating tactical cogitators. And three caught in slow field. Although they did damage to us because I wasn't paying attention. He's trying to run. He's trying. Oh, that that's a win. Resuming normal functions. That is one hell of a win. All right, let's get our auger probe out. Yeah, sure. Feel free to jump away. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Enemy ship sighted. Your orders. All right, AI, do what you want. Awaiting orders. Oh, hello. Battle cruiser. At least he's going to go through the mines. Enemy ship sighted. Right. You're going to be ramming my... Yes, probably. Aha! Activating tactical cogitation. Dodged. Right, Nova can. Worth it. Awaiting orders. I'm gonna avoid him because I'm afraid he might like ram me inside there. That's fine, I expect to lose escort ships. It's kind of the nature of the beast. Activating tactical cogitators. Yeah, sure. Hit me on the front. Doesn't bother me at all. I'm an Imperial shipmate. That stuff doesn't bother me. Activating tactical cogitators. Right, let's close the range. Ah, oh, god damn it, that damn frigate got in the way. Cruising speed set. Right. Keep going firing M. What about you? What are you? You're a light cruiser. Tactical cogitators. Again, reasonable damage. Certainly I'll get your money's worth of that Nova Cannon. Oh god. Try and get out of there. Don't think we will. Oh, oh, it's gonna be close. Oh no, we were hit. Understood. Activating Freeze. Turn. Oh, Tactical cogitators. Fail. 
Let's do a ram. I don't think we got that. Much as I would... Oh, no, we got it! He's dead! I can't believe we got him. Cruising speed set. Nice. Activating tactical cogitators. Okay, that guy's still pretty tough. Got to be wary. Helm coordinates acknowledged. I think this is the point where we bring in the goose pig. Setting course. Oh, he's running away. I mean, I can understand why. I mean, he shouldn't be, but I can understand why. We should have probably brought in the goose pig a little bit earlier. Lock on I won't execute him. Oh, for God, now you'd... Yes, I won't execute you either. We've got the advantage here. Enemy ship sighted. Come at me. Right, let's get to him before shield can come back. Nope. Not getting me that easily. Engines to maximum. Activating tactical about you? cogitators. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Will you be caught that easily? Changing Apparently. Ah, oh, that damn debris. Engines hot. Come on, get some good shots. Understood. Ah, stupid shield. Activating tactical cogitators. Ah, he got me. Activating tactical cogitators. Resuming normal functions. Now he's trying to get away now. There's not much I can do about that. Damage teams begin repairs now. Ah. Uh, oh well, we still got a number of kills there. Still victorious. Admittedly, a lot of filthy, deserting, abandoning, uncourageous, villainous, pussiliamous scum. That's actually the derivation of the uh, rebuke where you call someone a pussy, is it derives from pussiliamus, which is Latin for coward. Just, you know, because you should know these things. For whatever reason. Um, right, that is it for our turn. We did win. We've got a lot of renown sitting in the bank. Let's see if there's any upgrades to be done. And none of them got lost in the void. Hmm. Okay. Right, let's upgrade. Oh, you've got that maxed out. Let's get... Increase the emergency repair. Yeah, let's do that. A lot of skills. Let's get your master gunner. And upgrades. Ooh, now the upgrades, you should be really close. So we should get arm piercing ammunition, which is enemy armor always counts at 25% when firing at 3,000 units or less. That's the same as a lance, which is really kind of good, especially against tough armored enemies. The other choice is to go for longer range, or maybe uh, lances count against shields. But I think maybe getting in close and being able to do damage against these heavily armored people is good. Um, that said, Eldar, really annoying. Maybe trying to think of something, you know, good against Eldar. But for now, we'll just rock with what we've got. Let's max the gunner out there. Uh, what do we want over here? Probably the closing arm piercing ammunition, because we're fairly fast. Although that said, maybe extra speed is needed. Mm, no. Right, what we got? Extra range. 
Teleportarium. Turbo. Now, let's go for the close-in. I believe that is everything. We could unlock another slot, but I don't see the point in it. Got to save it before we get level 5 and get our battle cruiser. Okay. End turn. Was it this turn? Super invasion. Oh, yeah, that's right. Admiral Spire. Yes, Inquisitor. Gather every vessel you can and travel to Orm's world at once. You must stop Abaddon, whatever the cost. He is searching for an ancient artifact known as the Eye of Night. Do not let the despoiler claim this relic, Admiral. May the Emperor guide your guns, and may the heretics feel his wrath. Okay, so big battle. I can do this. Abaddon the Despoiler has launched an attack against the Orn's world system. I believe that what he truly wants is to seize another artifact of power known as the Eye of Night. Admiral Spire, you will take command of the assault force to break the chaos siege of Orn's world. It is crucial we keep this relic out of Abaddon's hands. I mean, without it, he can't nick the Blackstone Fortress. I mean, admittedly, he can't nick the Blackstone Fortress without the Hand of Darkness either, but whatever. Uh, so it's a planetary assault. Uh, the attackers have to reach indicated areas in time, and the defender must prevent us getting to the indicated areas. Okay. Uh, sure. The Chaos forces have butchered the inhabitants of Orn's world. Both humans and the native rattlings. Well, I like the rattlings. We have organized a large assault fleet to take back Orn's world from the enemy and to secure the Eye of Night on the planet's surface. My agents report that the relic is still here. We must move quickly. Admiral Spire, your orders are to escort the assault force and break through the chaos defenses around Orn's world. This situation is critical for the Gothic sector. Therefore, I will personally lead the planetary assault from your ship's command deck. Oh! Oh, he's going to usurp me. Oh, we get 600 points. Oh, yeah! Let's do this. I want me 600 points. Oh, we get 300. I'm assuming that the other points are taken up by my allies. Which is annoying. Um, sure, I mean, we could have two ships that would fill that quite nicely. Or... Two ships and some escorts? I'll just take my two ships. I don't know if you can put escorts in these positions to be able to do the like the bombardment stuff. Or whether it has to be ships of the line. I would assume it'd be ships of the line. So I'm just gonna go with those two. The Imperial forces on Orn's world will not be able to hold out against the enemy much longer. You have to hurry, Admiral. Inquisitor. Our fleet should push the Chaos ships away from the planet's orbit, so the counter-invasion transports can land. Agreed, Admiral. The Imperial forces will also need orbital fire support once we've finished the fighting in space. A few lance strikes will put these traitors off balance. Understood, Inquisitor. Let's send these heretics back to the Eye of Terror. Okay, so let's get Indeed, in there. Indeed, Admiral. I don't like that guy. That guy's weird. Indeed, Admiral. Uh, and then we'll get you to just come up closer. So they've got some defense platforms, and then we need to be at random locations on the map in a certain amount of time. Let's see how this works. Okay, and they've got lots of dudes. Engines hot! Admiral Spire. Yes. Chaos forces have taken control of the planetary defense platform. I noticed. Thank you. I don't need to do anything about them, they're Your just orders. annoying. Okay. I might just go Changing in here and hide in this cloud. Oh, hello. A Dauntless, and what else is there? 
Overlord, which is decided to go directly through an asteroid field. No, it's slowing down and leaving me to fight the enemy as it tries to navigate around. Enemy ship sighted. At least we've got an Overlord class. Um. Underway. Enemy ship sighted. There's a lot of enemies. Carnage class. Yep, I'm not going to be in that slow field. Thank you very much. Engines hot. Awaiting orders. Understood. Let's try and give some fire support, but I doubt it's going to be of much use. Activating tactical cogitators. Hmm, maybe. Activating tactical cogitators. We're going to get stuck in a slow field ourselves in a minute. Activating tactical cogitators. Enemy ship sighted. Oh, God. That's not helpful. Setting course. They really have just dumped everything on this guy. Course plotted. Oh, bomber wings coming in. I don't know anything to defend against those. Resuming normal function. Oh, no, 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 don't come over here. Tactical cogitators. Admiral Spire. Oh, we God. managed to confirm the position of a strategic chaos outpost on the planet. Wiping it off the map provides much needed support for the Astra Militarum troops. You must Go align for it. a ship to the outpost position and bombard it. Now. Orders received. You as well. It's central to the board. You can both try and get there. Right, let's see if we can get a good... You know what? Screw it. Let's get this guy with it, and then as we go past, we can hit him. His shields will be down. I've got a minute to get there. We could do a jump if I need to do a jump. I'd rather not. I took him out. Thirty seconds. All right, let's get that guy. Activating tactical cogitators. You um probably going to be fine. Yeah, let's not get caught. But I can't do anything about that. I could do a jump if I wanted to. Yeah, keep going. Activating tactical cogitators. Uh, let's get our repair on. And it's early, but this is going to be a long battle, I feel. Changing course. Five. Three. Two. Yes! The chaos forces on the planet have been crippled. And our troops down there are fighting more fiercely than ever. Execute high energy turn. Now we're going to turn that way. Fair enough. Activating tactical cogitators. Yep, you cogitate those tacticals. Oh god, we're gonna need to move pretty harsh. Did we not fire? Oh, I thought we fired our torpedoes. Cruising speed set. Oh well, let's get a little bit closer then. Oh, what? Oh, stop most of them. We still managed to get a little bit. We've located a there we go, right next to us. Position. Grab it. Who's running away? I'm guessing it's an ally. We'll deal the chaos yeah, that heavy traitorous blood. scum. We must not let this opportunity slip away. Right, you're going to get to the bombardment position quite easily. Reports from the Astra Militarum indicates that many Chaos strongholds on the planet have been taken down. Yes! We need to keep supporting their troops. Targeting enemy vessel! Uh, you've got a fire on board. Put the fire out. Initiate keep moving. Emergency repairs. 
Enemy defense platform destroyed. Ooh, the Overlord's taking a load of damage. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Your orders. Enemy defense platform oh. destroyed. Nasty. Understood. Yes, Admiral. Ah, uh, we're on fire again. And we're probably going to get quite a slow field. At least I get my torpedoes out. Awaiting orders. I don't want to use it on such a little raid. Oh, actually, let's use it on those raiders. Nope. Activating tactical cogitators. Yeah, they're going to get us. We're too slow on that one. Enemy ship sighted. Activating tactical cogitators. Okay, let's do a brace for impact and try and get that guy. Oh my god, we've taken so much damage. I'm not sure this is really winnable. Like, they Look outnumber us so it. much in terms of points. This is a boost. This is a boost. Ready? Ready? Cruising Red. Oh, no, no, no. A keep going. Chaos stronghold oh, crap. Is halting the advance of our ground forces. Get rid of it at once. That's going to be tough. Activating tactical cogitators. Cruising speed set. Come on. Yeah, one of them down. Activating tactical cogitators. Stop. Oh, just missed the torpedo that. Insubordinate. What? Activating one of them's running away already? Cogitators. We got lucky on that. Damage teams, begin repairs now. Cruising speed. Might need to jump on this one, I'm not certain. We'll have to see. Activating tactical cogitators. Yep, you cogitate those actuals. Right. No friendlies left. My god. I think we only need the... Th yeah, this is our third one, right? If we get to this, we win. So Your let's orders. use our ability. Awaiting Just in orders. case we get hit and then, like, we, like, Engines run away, hot. which would be annoying. Which we wouldn't do, because we're loyal Engine, to the Imperium, but, maximum. you know. Yes. Excellent. The last Chaos position has been retaken. The heretics have been wiped off the face of the planet. All ships, your valor has earned you a place in Imperial history. Impressive, Admiral Spire. Now that victory oh, is yeah. certain, we need to land on the planet to seize the artifact and ensure it stays protected. That's totally how the Gothic sector... What? Only 62? I think I've been, like, cheated out of renown there. For shame. Congratulations, Admiral. The last remaining Chaos forces are being slaughtered as we speak. Inquisitor, have our troops recovered the artifact? Unfortunately, no. An enemy transport ship has managed to escape with the Eye of Night on board. However, my agents have uncovered the location of a Chaos Space outpost where Abaddon intends to store the Eye of Night. All hopes are not yet lost. Oh god, not a space station battle. I like. I hate space... I still haven't figured out a way to adequately take them out. Oh my god, they're so tough. Uh, and there's two fights going on in Portmore, one of whom is Eldar. Although it is data... Oh, I've got a choice between Eldar and... That's an agricultural world. Those are agricultural worlds. That is... Always going to be there. 
Honestly, I'm going to do the data recovery from the Eldar because they don't have shields. As long as you can get to them, you can nick the data off them pretty easily. But I've been interested if you enjoyed. Please like, not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. And until next time, when we'll try and hunt down the Eye of Night, stay shiny.